Hey guys, Zach Birch here with Foul Militia. It's uh, opening day of our 2021 season. We're here, we just got our brand new Sea Ark Slayer boat. Um, today was the first day maiden voyage. I wanna go over it real quick, talk to you about it, show you some features, and uh, we're gonna put this thing through the test this year. And uh, you know we'll continue to give you updates throughout the season on how it performs and how it holds up to our standards. So we'll start up the front and we'll go to the back and check some things out. Um, one of the first things I saw on this boat that I liked, obviously, is this this hole to grab it and pull. We all know we have to get out of the boat and drag it some. Uh, it makes it real easy to pull it across mud flats or just you know into some shallow places. You've got your three uh, light light bar kit on the front. Almost every duck boat needs one of those. If you don't, you're going to be stuck in the old-fashioned way of holding the Q beam, which we know is inconvenient. Um, this boat is also completely lined on the inside with a gator hide. It's a 1652. Um, it's wired for a trolling motor up front as well. This can come off, obviously, after duck season, you put a trolling motor on it and start fishing. You've got your navigation lights. You've got storage in the middle here, which we have all our life vest and spare plugs, whistles, spare parts that we might need if we ended up losing one seat pedal stool base. Um, if you look, you can see going down both sides, we've got the Slayer orange LED lights, which are, um, it's the first time I've had orange lights in the boat. And they're actually pretty neat. I've had green and stuff in the past, but orange is a little bit different. And these lights too, they're not overpower. Uh, they don't overpower, uh, overpower you with brightness. So you get the light that you need, but you're also not blinded. So you can actually run down the lake and not be blinded in the morning, but you know, obviously most people shut them off. Come on back a little bit more. You've got storage under the front, and from the factory, they run a fuel line to the front and also to the back. So you can choose whether you want your gas tank to be in the back or in the front. Everybody's a little bit different depending on where you hunt, kind of how you want the boat to perform. They'll move their tank to the front or back. Uh, we prefer ours to be in the back, so that's where we've got it set up now. You've got options for a gun box. Uh, we opted out of it. We just feel like more of an open layout's better for what we do. So we've got this gun tray on both sides. You can, you know, set boxes of shells, anything you want to here. They're not going to slide off and go all over the place. Um, and on here to the back, there's a couple different options you can get to set up this back piece and this particular one is pretty much fully open and something i really like about this design in the back is this cover here it covers up your pumps your bilge area all that so it keeps a lot of debris from getting in there but at the same time you can take out a few screws take that whole plate off and you've got full access to all your wiring um, your bilge if you got to replace a pump uh, which we all know you, you have to have a pump that's functional when you're duck hunting, especially in bad conditions. Um, everything is super easily accessible. Uh, it's built really tough. We've got pods on here. We've got the LEDs on the back. The trailer, this particular one, has upgraded tires and wheels. That's an option. Um, your boat buckles on the back. Uh, gator hide on the trailer as well. It's a really nice trailer. This one comes rated for a 50 horse. Um, whatever you know engine you prefer this is uh this is a 50 mercury it performed great today it's got 13 pitch stainless prop on it we put a kick up plate jack plate on it um you know guys this is a brand new boat too from sea arc sea arc is a name that a lot of people are familiar with i'm pretty sure if you've ever had an aluminum boat or been around them you've heard the name sea arc uh, but it's a brand new design they've completely revamped things with this boat it's, it's got a major overhaul. Um, you know, we've run a lot of different brands in the past and had great success with them. We're really excited to start working with Sea Arc. Um, you know, open a day, we shot six limits of ducks today. Uh, it's a great way to break it in. We look forward to a great rest of the season.